we are going to Barossa Valley and I have lotion here for my arms because we had to sneak out of the house because David's not coming. See you there. Lavender farm and upon arriving we can already tell that they're not really in bloom because it's already getting really cold so you'd expect it to be pretty lavender purple um, but it's just green at the moment but the drive up was really nice and we're still driving to other spots that's how you kind of venture around Barossa um, but it's still a must do the drive I think is even worth it the views I don't know if you can see behind I can't see actually but in the valleys and stuff there's so many vineyards covering the hills which is so nice just watch for bees Oh, big ants. Really big ants. This is nice. It still smells nice. Even though there's not a lot. But in the um, lavender shop, it smells really good. Yeah. So good. There's a lavender liqueur. I can't get over that. I want to taste it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so curious. And there's a cafe here as well. What else do they have? Yeah, there's one here too. There's a hole. Okay, where to next? <laughs>
Hi guys, so, oh, my leg's itchy. I am home from our little adventure today and um, the parents, Enkiko took Yura and Aaliyah to the airport. Um, I fell asleep and David was already sleeping when we got back. So we didn't get to say bye properly, but we'll see them anyway. Um, because of this whole coronavirus thing kind of escalating and getting a bit crazy um, especially because like David doesn't really listen to me especially when we're in public he'll lick things lovely ow ow no I'm making a knot okay thanks he touches everything I know he's a child yeah they're gonna do mm. what they're gonna do case <laughs> in point <laughs> and it wouldn't worry me so much um, like if I didn't have David or if I wasn't pregnant, but I am a bit paranoid. Like yeah. I've been washing my hands so yeah. much yeah. more than usual. I used to wash my hands a lot anyway, especially when David was a newborn. My hands were all um, dry and flaky and all this stuff. And I don't know, I was just too lazy to put moisturizer on. Anyway, um, now they're... Um, just I don't know if you see that but they're just getting super bad anyway um, so because I am getting a bit paranoid um, I'm thinking of cutting our trip here a bit short even though I feel like Adelaide is one of the safest places and the most chill at the moment no one is panic buying Hi. <laughs> I am thinking of either catching a flight anywhere between Wednesday night um, or Saturday night because um, Andrew is busy and he can only really pick us up at night time. I also would just feel more comfortable being near Andrew if anything were to happen, if there was going to be a, a, like a city lockdown because there are rumors going around and if there is a Brisbane city lockdown that means we can't fly home, I'm pretty sure. My friends were saying, like, if anything were to happen, you know, he could just drive down. But I don't want to make him drive all the way if we can just fly earlier. So we're cutting our trip back about two weeks. Um, and yeah, it's been really fun. I'm ready to go home. I didn't think I'd be this homesick. Um, but yeah, that's just a little update. And I will keep you guys posted when I can. Be careful. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Hi guys, so just a follow-up update. Um, I tried to change our <coughs> flights home to Brisbane and they were allowing me to um, change and rebook my flights um, to, a, a, to an earlier date. But when I checked today, they weren't letting me do that. And I had to book new flights for both of us. And there was no option or I couldn't find. And I was looking for ages. I couldn't find an option to give David his own seat. So at the moment, he's sitting on my lap. It's all right, but he prefers his own seat. Did you drop your book? Yeah? Where did you drop it? Uh oh! When we check in and get there, I'm just gonna have to tell them that um, no one was answering their phones. I was on the phone for half an hour. One of Andrew's friends was on the phone for five hours and no one could help her, which is really annoying. I'm glad I hung up when I did. Um, and I'm just worried that they're canceling domestic flights altogether because I know Victoria and WA are. Um, so that's just the update. Um, it's Monday now, so we have about three days. And I'm just hoping that the flight isn't cancelled because the drive is about a day's drive. And I don't think that will be an enjoyable one. 
Mm. Yeah, where's the sun? Sun. Good job. Where's the shoes? Very good. Where's the water? Good job. Where's the clouds? Good job. Where's the bowl? Good job. Where's the star? Yay! Where's the balloon? Good job. Where's the slide? Yay! Where's the juice? Juice! Good job. Where's the sun? Sun! Yay! Very good. Thanks for watching guys. If you enjoyed today's video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and if you haven't already, please subscribe and I will see you in the next video. Bye!